Bruce Mail, a member of the uh, emeritus member of the Tufts Board of Trustees, and Sherman Teichman will introduce Sherrod Cigar. Thank you, Alan. Good morning. Good morning, President Monaco, Dean Solomon, members of the faculty, friends, and most importantly, the student recipients of the Presidential Award for Citizenship and Public Service. Congratulations to you all. It's both my pleasure and a distinct honor to introduce to you Sherrod Cigar. But first, I'd give you a few little statistical facts. Sherrod most recently has been awarded the Wendell Phillips Award and will be the baccalaureate speaker for the commencement services at Tufts this year. He was selected as one of the Forbes under 30, 30 under 30, sorry, for so his social entrepreneurship. He was selected as a, one of the Rockefeller 100 Next Century Innovators. And two times he has won the Tufts 100K Entrepreneurial Award, as well as the Paul Montel Prize for Entrepreneurial Innovation. Just a few minor little details. <laughs> With this in mind, let me tell you that Sherrod comes from a small village in the area of Patna, India, where his parents instilled in him and his siblings the value of an education, the results of, of hard work in the educational process, and what that can provide to you, and also a vision to dream big. We, being a part of this wonderful educational institution, know that education is the key to many things in this world. Knowledge, understanding, intellectual curiosity, professional development and advancement, social awareness, civic responsibility, and most importantly, the use of our educations to achieve the possibility of peace. But how many of us are concerned with not only our personal educations, but that of others? Certainly, every teacher in this room and every teacher in every university, for sure. But how many of us are concerned and want to help educate tens, if not hundreds of thousands of other students? Not too many of us. And this has been Sherrod's vision, his goal, and his passion. So while in high school, Sherrod devised a series of educational programs or platforms that would give students incentives and rewards to achieve more out of an educational process. It's called Dexterity Global, a nonprofit corporation. Sherrod met with hundreds of thousands of students, worked with public and private schools in India, negotiated with local and national governments, invited the participation of corporations and foundations. Since then, and while attending Tufts, he has assembled a team of over 200 volunteers, interns, and full-time employees to connect with over 300,000 families with scholastic and co-curricular opportunities for their children. To date, Dexterity Global has been able to offer educational platforms to over, and this is not a mistake, 1.2 million young students per year. With With this in mind, one might have the hope that someday one of those students who benefited from the Dexterity Global Platforms could further his or her education at Tufts University. Well, I am most happy to let you know that day occurred last fall when Suraj Priyadishi matriculated here with the class of 2019. Swaraj. It's my pleasure, and with great pride, uh, I congratulate you, Sherrod. Thank you. Just a few simple words. You've heard enough of me. The reason that the Institute and uh, Tufts University are able to prosper and to create these opportunities that Sherrod has taken full advantage of are uh, due to people such as Bruce Mail. Bruce uh, has uh, endowed and created the Bruce Mail Fellowship, which has enabled Sherrod and others to come here. We have benefited tremendously over the last decades uh, because of your philanthropy and your uh, service to this university, and we're extremely proud to have you on our board. 
Sherrod, um, you have really demonstrated the power of what a small gift can do uh, because our Empower grants are small but hopefully significant because you have taken advantage of the huge network that Ananda and others uh, have contributed to to make sure that there was a succession year after year uh, of beneficiaries such as yourself. And um, it is uh, a, a tribute to Tufts University to be able to attract people like yourself and yourself, Bruce. Sherrod is going on to uh, graduate work at the Harvard Graduate School of Education to continue his passion for global education and for equality. Um, and uh, despite what I might think about Samuel Huntington uh, and the Clash of Civilizations, you apparently are one of the finalists now for the Samuel Huntington Award in, uh, for graduates. So congratulations to you on so many levels. Uh, 